Greg Tepper, Dave Campbell's Texas Football and TexasFootball.com here at Northwest ISD Stadium where the Eaton Eagles pull out a 30-28 to win over Keller Fossil Ridge here with the head coach of the Eagles, Coach Ellis Miller. Coach, uh, it wasn't always pretty, but boy, it seems like you guys turned it on the second half. What changed for you guys in the second half? We, since we've opened, we've been a second half team. Our kids, for whatever reason, get their second win. They get going. They play with a little more energy. Uh, their line, old D line started to wear down. Our O line started to kind of move them a little bit, which I don't think that's happened to them this year. Um, but you know, when you play those guys, Coach Baccarini, they're they're so well coached. They're physical, and I knew it was going to be a war. So we were biting, clawing, whatever we could do to move the chains. And, and defensively, we were just trying to hold on. Yeah, you know, one thing I want to ask you about is, is the offensive line. You know, you mentioned a little bit about them. Uh, this was a, a really good Keller Fossil Ridge front, and, and you guys came out in the second half, and it seemed like you guys said we're going to take the fight to them. Do you feel like your offensive line maybe took it as a challenge at halftime? Oh, absolutely. Coach Baker, our, my old line coach, he uh, he kind of challenged them a little bit and, and got in their face a little bit, and they accepted it. And the, those guys, they work every day. They're lunch pail guys, and then, you know, when they started grinding their corn a little bit, I – I mean, I knew we were in good shape. Uh, defensively, four turnovers in the first half. You turned them over a few times, helped keep you guys in the game kind of while the offense uh, was scuffling. Uh, what was it about the defense that was working tonight? Yeah, that's a, that's a good point. I knew it, we were going to come out a little bit slow just because they're so good on defense. And, uh, you know, it, we – we got playmakers back there, and they uh, they had opportunities and made plays when they when when it mattered. And, and without those guys making them, who knows? But yeah, it's it's they're back there, and that's all they want to do is go get a milkshake from our defense coordinator. So, <laughs> well, now I do have to ask you because there's the third phase of the game, which seemed like it really turned the game for you guys, which was special teams. Special teams, you guys came up huge tonight. Uh, that's something you guys feel like you can hang your hat on. Absolutely, we have a we have a great special teams coordinator, and we spend a lot of time on it. We spend time before practice we spend two or three periods during practice um you know everybody said well we blocked a punt yeah we practice that and we practice lining up and we practice sprinting down the field and like i say when it happens it's something special especially with a team like this but it, you know we, we were ready for it i guess what do you feel like maybe you learned about your team tonight yeah, they're tough and, and i knew they were but you know they they i don't even think they realize how good that team is and, and I don't think they realize how good we can be if we'll continue to improve. Coach, appreciate your time. Yep.